Ooh. <laughs> All aboard the Purple Boy Hype Train. And today's destination is Avengers Infinity War. Yo, man, what's going on, guys? It's Purple Boy, and you're tuning into Purple Film. Thank you so much for stopping by and spending some time with your boy, man. Today, we're going to be talking about the five things that I'm looking forward to seeing in Avengers Infinity War. Uh, make sure you guys go ahead and drop a like on this video. And if you're new to my channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button, man, and come back for more. I'm really excited for Avengers Infinity War. I'm going to be going to go see this at 8 o'clock tonight. And man, I cannot be more excited. This is 10 years, 10 years of buildup of you know i wouldn't necessarily call it build up but we've been waiting for this movie for 10 years uh to happen man to see all these characters come together like like uh like they are and um this is like a dream come true for comic fans for marvel fans for superhero fans for fans of the mcu man this is this is really a dream come true and this this is this is beyond a movie man uh this is a this is this is a event uh something that you know that will probably be talked about years uh after it is over man but yo let's go ahead and get into the five things man that i want to see in infinity war these are five things that i have to see in this movie that to me will make it just an amazing experience you know what i'm saying it's got to do these five things so the first thing i want to talk about is the different tones have to mesh well even though most of all the marvel films have similar tones there are a few that are exceptions to the rule black panther is more serious while guardians of the galaxy don't take themselves seriously at all it's going to be interesting to see if they can successfully handle all these different personalities this really really has not been attempted at this scale yes of course we've had like you know the first two avengers films and then civil war but man this this is like maybe two or three times those movies so let's hope man that the different tones that they bring into this movie are going to mesh well and it's going to work and not feel off or you know take me out of the movie next thing i want to talk about is that the movie doesn't feel overstuffed back when it was first rumored that an avengers film would be made everybody and their mama wanted to know how the heck are they going to make this work all these characters coming together in one film can't possibly work right about six years later and here we are with three times that amount of the first film and quite honestly we're all still wondering how are they going to pull it off if we've learned anything from spider-man 3 is that being overstuffed isn't really a fun experience i do believe that pacing is a big part in this not feeling like it's too much as well so many characters it can feel like they're rushing through the story or it could feel very long trying to develop all of these characters so again that's going to be another thing uh that i'm looking forward to seeing man because th this is going to be a ridiculous balancing act for the russo brothers another thing i want to see in avengers Infinity war is that it has to have emotional weight is there is there's got to be some stakes not very often are the stakes felt in a marvel film infinity war has to make me feel like this is truly the end the mad titan thanos has come to balance the universe by collecting the all-powerful infinity stones and wiping out the human race okay cool story bro but will i feel it will it hit me in the heart man you know what i'm saying will it hit me is it gonna hit those feels are we gonna feel some weight in the action scenes or are they gonna be just hollow spectacle one scene i can use as an example is civil war like the last half hour of that movie tony finds out the truth about the death of his parents and that just sets off a series of events man that like oh my goodness man like literally i was in the theater like gasping man and it was so intense that entire fight scene that's what i want to see in infinity war another thing i really want to see stand out in infinity war is the black order I heard very little about the black order in infinity wars promotional campaign and i assume it is for a good 
reason. The little I have read is that the Black Order are Thanos' children, much like Gamora, um, and they do his bidding and act as his sort of, you know, four horsemen or five. I'm not sure how many there are, but they act as his sort of horsemen of the apocalypse. And I'm really expecting them to be this elite group of just badass villains who are likable and have some depth in their relationship to Thanos and Gamora. I've come to my last point I want to make about the things I want to see in Infinity War. And of course, this is a big one. The villain has to be compelling. One thing I've always said is that they haven't necessarily done a good job setting up Thanos before this movie. So now we have to get his backstory in a film that's already stuffed full of characters. I've heard some folks say that this is Thanos' movie, like that he's the main character, he's the villain and the main character of this movie. And then there are some who say that he has a few scenes. So tonight, you know, I'm going to find out for myself. Thanos being weak will seriously ruin this entire movie for me. I'm not even lying to you right now. So let's hope, hope that that's not the case because I'm still kind of feeling the burn from freaking Ultron. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comment section below if you're going to go see um, Infinity War tonight. Let me know. Are you excited? What are you looking forward to? What are some of the things that you can't wait to see or that you just absolutely must see in this movie in order for it to be great? I mean, we all, I mean, we all know it's going to be a great movie. It's going to be a good movie. It's going to have a lot of action, stuff like that. But these are just things that I got to see for the movie to really blow my mind away thank you guys so much for watching drop a like on this video click that subscribe button hey and the next film you watch i hope it encourages inspires and entertains thanks for watching